Hi everyone, welcome back. It's the Bent Knitter. So I was able to do my toe of socks and they came out really nicely. So here one is. Obviously the same. Well, the one is the same. Um, I don't know what the little gap is in the front, but um, I really enjoyed it doing toe up socks. I think this is what I might be doing when I whenever I do, do socks. I might just specifically look for toe up socks. I I'm not quite sure why this made such a difference, and I got so much more enjoyment out of doing the toe up socks. Maybe it was just doing the increasing than the heel relatively first and second. Um, maybe I enjoyed and just doing the kind of like the leg part, like the easier part for me at least, last was just kind of better for me. Anyway, I really liked it and I really, I highly recommend uh, getting this pattern. I will put a link in the description below in terms of where you can find it. I got it from Webs. It was like five bucks. Very cheap, very easy. So I'm very happy with how they came out. I'm probably going to be using this pattern a lot more for myself in terms of making socks um, just because I got much more enjoyment out of it than doing the top-down socks. I'm interested to hear what which way you guys prefer so get, let, drop a comment below and let me know um, but my next project I'm not actually not going to be doing any socks um, I'm actually going to do something a little bit bigger um, just because I like variation so I did a couple pairs of socks now I'm going to be using something a little bit thicker um, I'll put the description in the uh, the description below but uh, it's a little bit thicker I'm probably gonna make a blanket out of it I think I have a pattern in mind but this is Dunger Ease cotton and acrylic it's really nice it's kind of like a soft pink um, but I will let you know what next week what I kind of get into um, so I will see you then bye